We are now proceeding to the next step of our, our uh, uh, desktop and getting more understanding of what properties are on the desktop and take notice we get into what is known as a screen saver. Now our computers that we have in the lab and also <coughs> what you're going to receive are CRT or cathode ray tube monitors. Um, I did have experience with a business that did not use a, a screen saver and they had burned the image of their start page into their computer because it was sitting on there for extended periods of time. Once that image is burned into the phosphorus background of your, uh, of your tube, that image will be seen with everything you do on the computer. It will be impossible to remove it. The only remedy is to get another monitor. And at present, those uh, people that did that to their monitor, they're persisting with it. So that's their setting. A screensaver will uh, uh, prevent something like that. <clears throat> it will come up and constantly make changes on the screen that it will not be a permanent image and since there is movement covering the entire surface of your screen there will be no burning. Now take notice that the uh, uh, selection as we press the down arrow key we are able to see a list of what's installed on your computer for a variety of different settings of a screensaver. You can click any one of them and experiment to see which one you like. Also when you're on the web there are ways of uh, downloading specialty uh, programs for screensavers. For example, I downloaded a free program called WebShots and I'm able to have some very nice pictures displayed as my, as my screensaver. Now take notice on the bottom part of this uh, section is a uh, uh, monitor power. To adjust the monitor power settings and save energy, click the power button. This power button here will take us into another menu where we are able to, uh, uh, well it's promoted to save uh, uh, electricity by turning off the monitor after a specific period of time or to turn off the hard disk after a uh, specific per period of time. Take notice that uh, turning off the hard disk is, is uh, important because as the disk is spinning when it needs information, constant reading of, of uh, a uh, uh, screensaver will be going on. However, it will uh, uh, be a continued use in running your hard disk at many times unnecessarily. So if we shut down the hard disk, it will make use of a screensaver that uh, <coughs> is only needed. So if your monitor is shut down, you don't need a screensaver running. So that's a little bit of interesting thing. There's also a uh, part down here on the bottom for system standby or system hibernates. They are very similar that it will shut down while preserving everything that you have open on the desktop. When you turn your machine back on, it'll take you back to where you were when you left the computer sit by on its own. Now, on the general appearance, we are able to use different uh, appearances. The traditional view is with the blue borders, and we do have a couple computers in our lab that has this changed. So uh, we do have uh, uh, the ability to make changes the way we like it. Now one thing that is not mentioned on here is that if we should click on any one of these images here, we can change that specific image. So <coughs> it's very flexible that way. Settings. Settings has to do with uh, the operation of your, your uh, uh, monitor and uh, uh, how it's able to display images on it. At present, this particular machine that I have this set for 
is with a, uh, a medium 16-bit uh, machine and I have the screen re uh, resolution set to its max. So uh, this can be adjusted and uh, just recently with my newest machine I had to go in there and readjust it after, after some updates were installed to activate a second screen. So there is uh, uh, a lot of things in here that makes your computer work the way you want it to. This is the end of this lesson and uh, we are uh, able to uh, uh, know more about the operation as we proceed. This is only about the desktop and its appearance and how the the uh, uh, screensaver works and how you can make different selections. So as you play with your machine, you can be able to get more understanding of what we have just discussed. Remember, this does not con constitute for your attendance. You do have to appear in person and get the notes from me as they are provided. Thank you.